Hello everyone and welcome to Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. This was a very popular series on my channel last year when I played 2014. So I figured I would go ahead and play 2015 since the developers reached out to me and said hey we want to give you this game because we uh, saw that you played 2014 and we really enjoyed it so you had a lot of fun. And I was like, well, sh heck yeah, man, I'll take 2015. So here we are playing it. Apparently there's a lot of really cool new stuff, new tools, new just everything. So welcome to Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. <coughs> Do you hear the phone ring? It could be a new customer. Go to the desk and pick up the phone. I like how they emphasize phone to check what needs to be done. Who has landlines anymore, honestly? In this menu, you can view all of your waiting orders. Some of them are locked because you need more XP to take them. Here, you can take it, or if you not, you can pass without consequences. Oh, okay. All right, so let's see. Engine power has failed. List provided general, running gear, control, and repair list. Wow. That's pretty, uh, pretty intense for the first job already. All right, <clears throat> let's see what we got here, guys. We've got, um, I wonder if we should, let's see, let's look at our work order here. Oh, here you can see the details. If you don't like the job or cannot perform all the tasks, you can always end the job. You will get a refund for the tasks you've already done, but you'll miss the bonus for finishing the job. Please note the minimum part condition on the right. So, uh, repair the parts exceeding minimum condition of 79 percent looks like air filter holy mother sway bar front drive shaft sway bar end link a holy crap and then rear shock absorber oh, oh god the phone's ringing so we already know an air filter is one of them um oh in this mode, you can unmount parts from the car. Each part can be accessed from a particular selection or section. Okay, so it looks like we have disassemble mode. Nope, oh, we got the stupid little clips here. Hold on, we gotta take the clips off. There's one. There's two. And we've got three. Four. Air filter cover. And is there a examine mode? Yes. Whoa, okay. I got it. Yeah, part condition. All right, so let's go ahead and take this air filter off. We already know we need an air filter. So let's come on over to the computer. Uh, car part shop body Oh, body parts too? And a bank loan in case we get screwed. Um, engine. Air filter. 11 bucks. Cha-ching. Done. All right. So now we need to go to assemble mode. Let's put the new air filter in done let's put the air cover back on oh wow you got to choose like every single clip all right let's put this clip back on here no there we go sure that one and sure that one okay so bam done okay so we should be able to come over here and let's see uh inventory are you sure you want to sell it for a dollar sure wow we got like serious phone calls coming here oh wow uh general running gear control and repair wow there's like all sorts of jobs coming in here guys okay i can't handle this one at a time can i take this for like a t <gasps> auction center your garage an old factory test track Oh, this is awesome. We actually have different locations to go to now. That's actually really, really cool. Acceleration. Okay. Wow, this track is like so different. Making his dodge like tele like electric poles and going behind buildings in <laughs> this old abandoned alleyway. Okay, 
braking. Okay, nailed them all. Apparently there's other tests and stuff that we can do as well that are uh, part of the new Car Mechanic Simulator 2015. I'm assuming we'll get to those later on. Apparently there's tools now too? I guess like a tool chest? Whoa. Examine report. Uh, wow. I like this examine report now. Front drive shaft, 4%. Sway bar, front end link, 28%. Front drive axle C is 70, outer tie rod 71, wheel hub bearing 71, gearbox R4 72. Wow. <clears throat> okay then. This car is in a. Uh... Yeah, see, see, look, check out this once in a while. You'll get XP uh, that you can spend on upgrades. Fast unbolting. Ooh, oh, we can unbolt faster. Fast disassembly, fast manual examination, repair tools, compression testers, electronic meters, and OBD scanners, and paper towels. All right, um, we got to get this thing on a lift. Uh, move car. Uh, test path parking. Test path. Uh, left lifter. Oh, this is awesome. Up she goes. All right, so <clears throat> apparently air filter has changed. Good. So we have to, uh, anything that's under 79%. So the front drive shaft is one of the first things here. The uh, front drive shaft is what we're needing to replace here. All right, so let's see. That's the catalytic converter, steering rack, front drive shaft. All right, so in order to take these off, we have to take the tires off. Okay, so let's go ahead and start with taking off the tires. Disassemble. Looks like we're going to have to take both tires off. Okay, let's take this one off. Nailed it. All right. <clears throat> now, now that we've got those off, we can take these off now. Got it. Okay, now we can take this off. Now we can take this off. Done. Okay, so let's... Uh, there used to be a, work pen, a workbench in the old one that had like a vice or something on it. Oh, there it is. Repair table. Nothing to repair, so we're gonna have to buy a brand new one off of our fancy computer over here. All right, so which one do we have? We have a front drive shaft that we have to repair. All right, car part, um, running gears, front drive shaft right there. <coughs> buy for 160 bucks. All right, let's come on back to the, oops. No, we want suspension, not the ex, nope. We want the suspension, there, there we go. All right, assemble mode. Ta-da! Okay, let's put this one on now. Now we can put the tires on. All right, got to do that star pattern, man. I tell you, people burn you at the stake for not doing it, even though it really does not freaking matter in this game. Just saying. Assemble mode. Put this last tire on. Wow, we definitely need to upgrade this ratcheting. All right, so now let's check our work order. Bam, front drive shaft is complete. Now we got to do the rear shock absorber, rear shock absorber cap, rear suspension arm A, and sway bar front end link. 
sway bar front end link. I think I just screwed that up. Um, sway bar front end link. Hmm. That's the one that's bad. I gotta take that one off. Alright, <clears throat> disassemble mode. Oh, we gotta take the tire back off again. I should have paid attention to the work order. <clears throat> I don't like how they put it at the bottom there. They should have put, like, all the front and the front and the back and the back, but whatever. That's fine. I can deal with it. Okay. So now I'm going to take this off. Luckily, luckily, it's just the tire. Luckily, it's just the tire. Okay, so let's come on over here. Oh, wait. First, first, first. Let's see if we can repair it. I always like to see... Nope. Can't repair it. Okay, so let's come on over here. Put this here, so we need a front sway bar uh, end link. Hmm, did I pass it already? For, oh, right here, F a sway bar front end link A. That's the right one. I always like to make sure that's the right one before I purchase it. All right, 29 bucks, not too bad. Not too bad at all, okay. So let's swing it on around here. Let's go to assemble mode. Let's oops. Let's put this back here. Just like that. Get that. Is that bolt? Is that in already? Oh nope, down here. Okay, it's in. Oh, let's swing around. There we go. Alright, now <clears throat> let's check our work order. Bam, done. Now, rear suspension arm A, rear shock absorber cap, and rear shock absorber A. Hmm. All right, let's see. Uh, suspension, rear... All right, let's see. Examine mode. Oh, that one's bad. Oh, and there's our other culprits over there. There's our shock absorber, our cap, and this guy, rear suspension arm A. <clears throat> All right, so rear suspension arm A... I want to take apart this, but we it looks like we got to take apart the spring, which we got to take off the rear shock cap, the spring, the spring cap, now the rear suspension arm A. Okay, so let's go take care of this rear suspension arm A. Let's see if we can repair it. Ooh, we can. Are you sure you want to repair? Chance of a repair, 40%. Eesh. You did not succeed. The park condition decreased. Gosh, dang it. We got to go buy another one. <laughs> That's kind of cool that you have a chance of fixing it and a chance of making it worse. All right, so we need a rear suspension A. Suspension arm? Is it rear suspension arm? Yes, it is. Okay. Rear suspension arm A. $145. Man, how come there's not a sprint button? I want to run in the mechanic shop. All right, suspension. All right, let's see. Assemble mode. Let's put this brand new one on since I failed so mis miserably at fixing it. Nailed it. Okay, spring cap. The spring. And the rear shock absorber cap. Bam. Done. Okay, now this side of the suspension is the... I like how things are rusty. That's bad. Alright, so we need to take this off. And this off. Bam. Done. Okay, so now let's go see if we can repair these. Nope. <clears throat> Alright, so we're going to have to buy those guys. We are going to have to buy them. Oh, there's a first aid kit, just in case we get a, a boo-boo. All right, so we need a rear shock absorber cap and a rear shock A. All right. Um, rear shock A and a rear shock absorber cap. Cha-ching! Cha-ching! Jobs waiting for... Oh, my gosh, we have jobs piling up, guys. I need to, like, pick up the pace here. Suspension. Assemble mode. Put the shock back on. Beautiful. And let's put our rear shock absorber cap on. 
Bam. Done. Does that mean that we're done? Oh, everything is green light. Green light! Finished job. Oh, that was sick. One job down, boys. One path test. 3,000 experience, huh? Paint. Oh my gosh, we can do a paint shop now, too. What's up here? Can we come up here? No, we can't go up there. Got a little, like, waiting lounge area. Can I turn the TV on? No. What happened to... Ooh, the oil. The oil pan. Okay. Get off me, dude. Get... Get... How do I get this thing off me? Okay. Stop. Stop. I don't want this thing anymore. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Can I put you back? Stop. Drop it. Stop. Drop and roll. Oh, God. Oh, God. I just... Okay. I'm sorry. I don't want to use this anymore. I just want to leave it. I'm just, okay. I guess we're going to carry this around with us now. Oil drain. I just... Oh, my gosh. I want to drop it. I don't know how to drop this thing. <laughs> we're stuck with the oil thing now. Um, wow. I can't even interact with anything anymore either. <clears throat> it won't even, like, let me, like, release this thing. Oh, Okay, escape works. Okay, Whew. thank goodness, escape. Oh my gosh, that was close. Super, super close, guys. Okay, so we have, like, jobs lining up here. Um, general running gear control and repair. Um, general engine control and repair. Find and fix any running gear problems. Wow, and then these ones we need available experience from 1506, and our experience is only 140. Ouch. All right, guys, well... That's where I'm going to wrap up the very first episode of our Car Mechanic Simulator at 2015. Hope you guys are enjoying this series. It's going to be a lot of fun, very technical, and I look forward to it. Hope you guys are enjoying our new garage as well. We'll see you guys in the next video.